Hey guys, it's Simplicity, and welcome back to, I think this is part 10 of the 100 Baby Challenge Season 2. So right now, Kennedy is awake. She is up, I was going to say she's getting ready for school, but she's not, considering it's a Saturday. I'm just going to have her get up and get herself kind of situated and good to go. And then she can come over here and go for a joyride. Um, I'm going to go ahead and wake Avia up. She can go, actually, you know what, I'm going to let her sleep. She can take a shower and use the toilet when she gets up. And the kids will, um, Waylon's asleep. Callie is still awake, so that kind of sucks. I love Kennedy. She just, like, cleans up for herself. Such a good kid. I haven't recorded in a while, if that's not obvious. Oh, well, like, I have been recording, but, like, this is my first time recording in, like, a few days. So it's kind of weird, but... Um, we got some upset kiddos right now, so that's always fun. But I want her to finish sleeping, so it's kind of like a lose-lose. Never mind, she's awake. Okay, so I'll let you go ahead and feed her on the floor. Yes, I know, she's crying, just feed her. Alright. So Callie's gonna get some food so we don't have another crying baby. We'll also go ahead and feed... Waylon on the floor. I keep forgetting his name. But I lied. So Callie's good. She's got some food. We'll wake Waylon up. Let him get some food. Callie really needs to go to bed though. She hasn't slept. So that kind of sucks. Okay. Put the kid through the child uh, through the crib. Alright. So you can feed her and then put her in the crib for me please. So we don't have a crying baby. Um, he's in a great mood, so he can actually just do whatever he decides. But Callie's gonna go sleep, and then I'm gonna send... So you know what? I was gonna send Avia back to bed, never mind. She's just gonna get up and get going for the morning. That's what she's gonna do. And then I'll let you... I don't know. Why are you crying? Okay, he's good, but I'm gonna move him over here so he's not, like, inside the crib. Alright, so we're going to get Avia up and getting herself ready, let Waylon take care of himself for a little bit, and then I think we'll get started teaching him how to talk. We'll finish teaching him how to talk, I don't remember. I really don't remember. Alright, let's get her to take a shower. She wants to teach Callie to talk and toss Callie in the air while well, Callie's sleeping, so that doesn't work. And he's over here playing with the blocks, so I'm glad he found a toy. But we are going to teach him how to talk because he doesn't know how to walk and use the potty. So that's good. Alright, I've had enough of this. How about you invite over your aunt because you do want to be friends with her. I thought that was really cute too, all the want to be friends with Audrey. And like Audrey's the one that Avia is the closest with, so I think it's really, really, really cute. She just had a absent-minded moment. Okay, eat some cake. Alright, so apparently Audrey's going to come over, which is great. I am going to change her, though, into her everyday wear, just so she's not wearing the weird, like, helmet thing. And then, after you do get your cake, you can come and change him into his everyday wear. And then we'll teach him how to talk. And there we go. Alright, now, Kennedy, you're going to put a good mood. We're just going to wait. Oh wait, you can't do anything with the mailbox. Wait, wait. I don't know. We're just gonna wait. Well, I could get you to go play with a toy. Just gonna let her go play with a toy for a little bit. While we wait for... Actually, you know what? There's no point, because Audrey's here. Never mind. And there she is. I don't know where she's going, but... Here's Audrey. Um... I'm making sure she's not pregnant. It doesn't look like it. Okay. Uh, we'll come in and bite her inside, because this is not the dress I put her in. I might have deleted the one that she was in, though. That is possible. Alright, so you're going to go ahead and clean up your dish. Thank you. And then we're going to go and get Waylon learning how to talk. really wish I had the clip, actually. No, I don't think I have the clip anymore. I was going to say I might actually have the clip. But I don't think I do. I gotta put that back in my game. 
very useful for this challenge. Alright. So they're gonna go inside. I'm gonna let you come and ask her about her day. Cause it seems like she really has like taken a liking to Audrey, which is great. Uh, you can make a silly face and tell her a funny story. But yeah, I don't know. Audrey's like the only one that she's willing to want for, so they're actually not fun, so that didn't take too long. And now she wants to have a pillow fight. I'm assuming Audrey's gonna go use the bathroom. Yep, I thought so. Well, that's alright. Okay. So, um, she just had like a finding out that she's pregnant moment. It scared me quite a bit, actually. So yeah, Avia is pregnant, which is exciting. We're having a possible alien baby. Gosh, that's weird to say. Um, alright, so after this you can go ahead and ask Audrey to a pillow fight, because it is something that she wants to do. Hayden is now the father of a new baby girl. Rebecca just gave a birth to a baby girl named Lakeisha. Wait, really? I didn't even know Hayden was expecting. What? Okay, here's Hayden. Oh, they did have a baby. She's friendly and loves the outdoors. Well, we're gonna have to meet her. Some of the kids aren't showing up. Mmm. Clay is not showing up for some reason. Lakeisha, I can understand because she was just born, but... Well, there's so many grandbabies. And Miss Italy found herself a boyfriend. And she's got a half-brother named Jason. Okay. I haven't paid attention to this family tree in a while. Should probably do that. Oh well. She wants to have a girl. I'm not gonna... That could happen. I don't know. Look at how cute they are. Oh my goodness. This is so cute. I think Audrey wins for the best Annie Award right here. That's adorable. Alright, so we're gonna get teaching him how to talk. Kind of outside, kind of not. It's in like a little entrance area. Alright. So we're just gonna fast forward through this. Um, I'm gonna walk in the girl thing just because it will happen at some point. Alright. So Miss Callie, how about you come and use the toilet for me? She's flattered from a compliment. Oh my goodness, Audrey complimented her. Oh, that's the cutest thing in the world. That is so cute. I'll let her wash her hands. Just because her hygiene is like a tad bit low. Plus, I really should have my sims wash her hands. But okay. So Audrey's in the kitchen eating some horrifying quality goopy carbonara. I was going to get her to eat some too, but it's spoiled, so you can come and eat some cake. Alright. So if Audrey gets sick, it's not her fault. But I am going to get rid of it. Put this in the garbage. There we go. Just so Sims don't take it. Uh, Terry and Hayden have moved in together. Alright. Can't say I expected that, but... Taking care of his niece, I guess. Okay. So I'm gonna come and get Miss Callie. I'm gonna come and tickle her. And snuggle her. Tackle her with the claw. Should've woke up a while ago, because her sleep schedule is now, like, messed because of me. And Waylon... Yeah, Waylon. Can come and use the potty. And then... I don't know. I don't know. Let's see where we'll go from there. We'll focus on the twins right now. I also really need to do a pregnancy makeover. I just thought about that. But she doesn't really have much of a belly, so I don't know. And we'll go ahead and feed her. Just so she's not hungry. I feel like that's all we've really done to Cali today. Alright. We will feed both of them. There we go. Okay. Go and feed him. Thank you. And then I'm going to let her come over here and use the toilet. 
Um, Callie needs to pee. And apparently Kennedy is over here playing with the Wiggles. I actually don't want you to do that. I want you to keep socializing with your aunt because how cute you two are. Uh, friendly. Let me see. I'm going to share a secret with her. And then you can gossip with her. And... Play rock, paper, scissors. That works. Because she, she is a kid, so I mean, rock, paper, scissors makes sense. Alright, Waylon, we're going to finish teaching you how to talk. Or, like, getting close to teaching you how to talk. Um, Callie's in a pretty good mood. Alright, and then I'm going to get Kennedy to go to bed after that. Just because it is getting kind of late. Alright. So we're just going to teach Waylon how to talk a little bit more. Um, Kennedy, uh, not Kennedy. Playing pretend is so much fun. Oh, she's so cute. Um, Avi is getting a little bit tired, so. This probably won't last too long. But Callie's over there playing with the dinosaurs. Oh, is it a horse? I think it's a horse. Two completely different things. Alright. So he's about, no, it looks like he's about halfway through his learning how to talk. Um, he is quite tired though, so I think I'm going to get his mommy to come and change him. Change his diaper up. I really like using this thing. I think it's cute. Alright. So he's been changed, and then we'll go ahead and put him to bed whenever we can. Put in crib. Come on. Put him to bed. And then we're going to probably do the same to Callie. And just so we're not having to take care of her, we will come and change Callie. Okay. And I believe Audrey is still here, I think. Put this toy away. But okay, so we will go ahead and change Callie. My game's frozen. Alright. No, oh, apparently our alien's getting kind of old. Alright. So you can go ahead and put her in the crib as well, and then I'll let you come over here and eat some cake. Because that is the only thing in the fridge. I am losing my voice. Oh my goodness. And then she'll go ahead and head to bed, and I'll skip to the morning. Alright, so we are back, and it is morning. Uh, Kennedy is awake right now. She's gone to get herself some food. Um, upstairs, we have a little guest up here. Audrey ended up staying the night. So that's kind of cute. But I'm perfectly okay with it. If any of them want to stay the night, that's fine with me. But okay, so she's going to go ahead and eat her cereal. Um... That's pretty much it for right now, honestly. What is this? Oh, Spring Festival is in town, you guys. So maybe we'll go ahead there at some point. Maybe. We'll see. Because we can meet some guys there. So. I need Kenny to do her dishes. Um, Wayland's awake. Avi is exhausted. But I'm going to let her come and feed Wayland just so we don't have a crying baby. I gotta change up the pregnancy oil. Should probably do that. Alright. So we'll go ahead and feed Waylon. And there we go. Happy baby. And we'll answer this phone call. It is Fog. He wants to know if we want to chat. No, we do not. But I do want to invite him over. Just because I need to get his traits and stuff like that for the family tree. That's honestly the only reason. Because I'm going to send her back to bed, so... <laughs> you know, she's going to go to bed and I'm just going to have him here. Alright. Go to sleep, Miss Avia. Okay, Waylon. Should probably get you to go pee. Okay, come use the potty chair. Um, Kennedy is out here playing with her toy. But she does actually want to play in the ocean, so I think I might send her over here by herself. 
I never know where to do this interaction. Um, I will find it. I hope. Hmm, let me see. Okay, there it is. Um, plate in the ocean. So she's gonna go ahead and head over here. And yeah, that's about it, honestly. We're just waiting for her to get here. So she's gonna go do that. Callie is sleeping. Avia is sleeping. Alright. Mm, I don't know. There's really not too much going on right now. But I'm gonna bring Waylon in here. Just so he's not like disturbing anybody. And we're gonna be on the lookout for a little alien friend. Because he's here. It says she's on a date. I'm gonna wake her up actually. Let her come and get some food. I don't want her on a super messed up sleep schedule too. And we're gonna wake up Callie too. We'll feed Callie on the floor. And then you can go and make some food. I don't really care what she makes. So we know that he's a good kisser. Okay. And now to find, no that wasn't hard. Found him. So over here, this is Fog. Uh, what, what he's facing over here. I'm gonna take his screenshot for the family tree right now too. So, hopefully you guys don't mind. He really doesn't look very happy. I'm gonna have her come over here and ask to just be friends with him. Even though he is like an older alien, so we probably shouldn't have to, but... I don't know. Um, family tree photo. Alright, so here he is. That is the father of the next baby. I'm gonna get his traits here really quick. Um, I forget how to do this. Not in there. Is it status? Personal? Okay, here it is. So I'm gonna go ahead and write all of this down into, like, a thing and like on my page for his like mood and stuff, uh, not his mood, but his trades and stuff like that. And then we will be like right on back. Alright, so we're back. I just finished letting it down for the family tree, which you guys will be seeing. It's linked down below if you guys want to go check it out. But yeah, this will be, it'll be updated whenever you guys are actually seeing this. So that's kind of cool. But alright, so we're going to go ahead and feed Miss Callie, get her some food. Good morning, Audrey. Audrey's awake. Please is a crowd for romance? No. Alright. Still need to give her a makeover because her shirt doesn't work with her stomach. It like glitches out and it looks really weird. Um, yeah, so here we're going through a breakup. Oh, he does not like us. He does not like her at all. Whoops, and she now has the exploring her options reputation. I don't know if she had that before or not, but it's showed up now. Alright, so he's gonna leave. Bye bye, little alien friend. We're gonna get the mail. She's in a really bad mood right now. And then we'll come over here and serve some pancakes. Alright, both the kids are in a good mood. Um, Kennedy, I might get to bring home. Avi gotten a gift from Ian. There's a letter from Leland. Uh, Ian. And that was just, yeah, so apparently Ian's still like really into her. But the stomach thing, it's, no, I'm not up for it. So I'm gonna go hop into Stylist. You guys are just gonna watch me do this. I'll fast forward it through. And then we will be back whenever I am done her makeover and stuff like that you guys know how this goes by now i would hope but yeah we will be back when i am done her makeover
way back. She is now how to make a visit. Now she's currently invisible, as you guys can see. But here it is, and here we got an updated belt and baby bump. I think this outfit is so cute. By far one of my favorites right now. Plus it's spring, so it's not like super nice, but it's not like freezing. So I think this outfit actually works really well. Oh my goodness. We broke up with the alien and he died. Oh, he died from a little heartbreak from my little Olivia. That's kind of really sad. But okay, so she, I'm going to go in here really quick. See if we can get that. I think it's a clean slate. I think. Um, start over in romance. Is it that one? Is that the one that we want? No bills ever could be kind of helpful as well, but not needed. Uh, stone-hearted, tragedy and heartbreak don't affect these sims. No, I think it is that one. I think it is the clean slate. So that should also get rid of her reputation, I would think, right? I don't know, I think that's the one that we're going to go ahead and get is the clean slate. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm, there we go. So we now have the, the clean slate. Hopefully it helped. The reputations were cleaned up and nobody remembers how bad or good she was. Okay. Well, that's all right with me. I don't mind. So now she's just friends with Ian. Okay, cool. No, that works out really good, actually. I really like that. And that is going to be really useful for this challenge, if you think about it. But all right. So let her finish eating. Kennedy's going to come on home. I don't know what just happened, but something happened. I would have been the playing in the ocean thing, wouldn't it? That's right, who's crying? Waylon, what's wrong? Play with legs. There we go. Happy baby. So, let you finish making up these pancakes while Kennedy is on her way home. I think it's really cute that Audrey's still here, too. Alright. As you can hear the video games. Um, Tristan and Bella Bachelor have gotten hot and heavy for each other apparently. Put the pancakes away. And then I think I'm going to send her over here to use the toilet. And then let her go ahead and if I can click on it, take a nap. Just because her energy is not all too great. Uh, Jasper and Sandy are still inseparable apparently. You can come and watch some TV for a little bit. Uh, kids are both in pretty good moods, so that's good. I'm going to let you come and play with the dollhouse for a little bit, though. I think that's a good idea. Alright. So, you had to, yes, I know you're tired, honey, I know. Alright, so she's going to go use the bathroom and then head off to have a little bit of a nap. I can't believe Fog passed away. That's actually really sad, but I'm happy I invited him over when I did to get his traits. Or else our family truly wouldn't have, like, it would work, but I like having the traits and stuff like that. I don't know. I'm probably weird. But okay, so she's going to go ahead and take her nap. Um, Callie's also quite tired, actually. I don't let her come and use the potty chair. And actually, I'll get Waylon to go ahead and do the same thing. But I think it's pretty much time to go ahead and wrap this up here. I'm going to let you go take a quick shower and use this toilet over here. But it's time to wrap this up. If you like this video, give it a like, comment down below. If you want to see more videos from me, hit that subscribe button down below. And I will see you guys all in my very next video. Alright, bye guys.